guys, the Adam Gaskins here. Um, in this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to get a cartoon, cartoony render in Blender. So, I'll go ahead, new scene, delete the default cube, shift add, mesh, shift A, add mesh, monkey. And I'll just leave it like that. Go to top of you, rotate a little bit, control alt zero. So now this is what the camera is going to be seeing. That looks good. I'm going to select the monkey, control 2 to add a subsurf modifier. It's shading smooth. Now, really, all the work is done in the um, materials. So I'm just create a new material, set the um, shader for the diffuse to tune. Same with the specularity. So I'm going to set the color to blue this time. And intensity all the way up. Size up to, I like 0.8. Leave the smooth at 0.1. Um, for the specular, turn the intensity up and turn it down to 0.1. And preview on monkey. See, that looks nice and shiny. Um, so we can render it. And it looks pretty good, except there's all this ugly black space. What we could do is just add another light, but then that could get kind of tedious. I mean, this isn't really a nice light setting. But if you're having trouble with black spots, then you can go to the world panel, go down to environment lighting. I'm going to turn mine down to 0 0.25. And when you render it, it gets rid of all that darkness and it replaces it with dark blue. So I'm going to just turn it down to 0.5. Save it as to render and render. Okay, that works. You only need a very slight environment lighting. There we go, that's looking good. You can just play with some settings here and there, but we're just going to stick with that because I'm trying to keep this tutorial short. Um, I uh, uploaded an HD video of a turntable around this, and you'll notice that it had a little black outline, which that looks really cool. You can do that by going to the render panel, scrolling all the way down, post processing, turn on edge, set the threshold to 30. You can play with the threshold to make more black lines or less black lines, but I think 30 is a good balance. So now you can you see you have a nice black outline. And if I go to the world, increase the environment lighting, then you can see the dark lines better. And they don't just go around the perimeter, they go inside the model to add more definition. So that's pretty much it for this tutorial. Um, I, you should check out the HD turntable, well half turntable of Suzanne. Except she's like brown I think. But yeah, so thanks for watching.